basically at first I was a bit like nervous for the fact that it like completely changed onto online and they said it kind of like in a short notice but the Intex team sort of like prepared us because they had like webinars and like the day before they had a webinar explaining like how it's gonna go and like the format so it made it it made me feel very more at ease because Intex like assured me that no matter what happens they're always there to like help me it made me very happy because I think traveling and going to another country and all stuff like that, like finding Airbnb, it will like make so, such like stress. So it was better for me to like stay at my like parents' home and like in my room just reading uh, the day before and because I was in a comfortable place. The online entrance exam was actually a good thing for us because due to the COVID, traveling would have been difficult and I felt like it was a good option and having single choice questions just made everything way easier. I think I was very afraid but I was kind of relieved and happy when it was online because I could do the whole thing from home environment I know already I felt comfortable and it was to be honest way more easy and comfortable than I thought it was going to be. I booked flight tickets and I didn't listen to my parents, uh, I should have. I booked the flights before, so I had to cancel them. But um, I mean, it is what it is. Nobody could know that this is going to happen. So this was actually the only thing, just the flights. And I had to cancel them, but it was worth it. Before the exam, I made sure I prepared really well and I made sure to go through the questions again and again and I also um, made sure I was quite relaxed before the exam. The day before the exam I actually didn't study at all, I just wanted to relax. Uh, so I went to, a, to the water world with my brother and I spent the whole day there because it's, I heard it's not good to study the day before an exam. On the day of the exam I had actually the first, I was the first batch so my exam was really early, so I woke up uh, like two hours early, so I woke up at six, had coffee, had breakfast, a very uh, big breakfast, <laughs> so I had a lot of energy and just sat in front of the computer like 15 minutes before the exam and I, it started. For me, I think it was pretty smooth. Um, I just woke up, um, drank a coffee, um, made a nice breakfast, like just chill, didn't look at anything so I don't get a blackout. Um, a couple of days before the exam, Demeter from Interhex organized a webinar. During the webinar, he was basically just reassuring us that we would do good, which I think was really necessary for people who were panicking and also he went through the instructions with us and that was good as well, just to clarify the things that we were not understanding. And for me, after the webinar, I actually printed the instructions down. So during the exam, I had a, um, the copy of the instructions next to me. What I found most, uh, like what I found the best was the I think it was the last seminar on the, the exam. Um, I think Dimitar gave the webinar. And that was one day before the exam, entrance exam. And I found it very useful because it was very reassuring. And Dimitar was like, guys, don't worry. You got this. And he was like giving us hope and giving us strength for everything. And I think that was very good. I attended the classes that were provided by Interex where a senior student would help us understand the questions and the answers. For me, I think in my time zone, the exam was at 9 a.m. or so. So I got up early and I have a note. I have two sheets of paper with all the hard questions in it. So I just revised those questions. So in my mind, all the hard questions were out of the way. So I was confident the easy ones are going to be easy. Our exam was online because of COVID. And mine started at 11, we had different time slots where we had our exams. Um, we could choose if we would start with chemistry, biology or English. And then when we finished it, we could do another one. I took my time, I um, read really carefully through, through the questions, so really slowly that I got everything um, a few times, even if I was pretty sure of the answer. I looked at them after, after I had all the questions, I looked at it again and checked. Because I had enough time, 
and um, checked if everything was fine and I think it was doable. It's not really, really easy, but also not really hard. I think when you prepare yourself, then it's, it's okay, it's easy, yeah. The entrance exam went quite well. Um, I maintained a quite relaxed environment around me before the exam and during the exam, um, yeah, I thought it went okay. I found the exam quite simple, um, but that was because of the resources I was given by Interhex. And I would say it probably took me a lot less time than that was needed to complete the exam. I took my time uh, through the exam. Um, I finished really fast, but I made sure to check all the questions and just even if I, I was done checking, I let the time go and I, was, I just submitted the last minute. <laughs> it was 40 minutes for each session, so bio, chemistry and English. So in total, it was two hours. I actually chose chemistry first because I thought that was the hardest. Uh, and then I went to English because it was the second hardest for me and then biology. I think it was a lot easier than I planned it out to be. I spent my whole summer studying for it, like every single day. My parents were always telling me to do it from day to night. So everything was sent by like the like by you guys from like by Interhex for, from the my email, and it was super simple. Like the links were sent um, to everybody, and I just made sure I had the link opened up and I looked at the platform before. It happened, it shows like bio, chem and English. So it was really like straightforward. And um, yeah, that's basically what it is. So the questions that like I immediately knew an answer to, I did all of those first. And then any ones that like I was a bit like not sure about, I did those at the end. But like overall, like it was faster than I thought it was going to be, like much faster. Uh, the only thing that was different is that um, there were a lot of instructions to follow. So I actually printed the instructions and so that I would not panic. So that made everything easier because um, if you actually close the page, you could get terminated. So I think um, the website was a bit more strict and that was a bit hard, but generally I thought the exam was well, but the English part was a bit difficult because you think I grew up speaking English, but then um, I'll just say don't take English for granted. To be honest, I thought it's going to be way harder, but if you stick to everything that you guys provided, that Interex provided, all the material, and just stick to it and learn like constantly and not last minute, you're going to be completely fine. Of course, as I think everybody else, I was stressing a lot, but then I thought about everything and I was reassuring myself that I know everything. I did the stuff, I, ha I did what I had to do, and uh, it actually went very fast. I think I was, 20 minutes out. That was very good. So the, the online exam went really well because um, we, we got like three modules and stuff and we sort of like went through it uh, and the platform was easy to understand. It wasn't like really difficult. The questions were mostly like MCQs. They, they, they weren't like open uh, questions. So you didn't have to like type a lot. You just have to like, there will be like four um, like answers and then you just had to like choose which ones were like which one was the right one. I started with biology because it's like my favorite and I I thought like I would get kind of like confident when I start with biology so I started with biology then I moved on to chemistry because I just didn't want to leave it to the end because chemistry kind of <laughs> freaks me out <laughs> and then I, I, I ended with English because English is kind of like I don't know, I, I enjoy it and it feels very calming. So I wanted to end the test with English. I was really, really anxious because like, I was already in Bulgaria and it, it, would, it would have been disheartening if I had to go back because like, I like sort of didn't do well. But, but, um, like I remember like we were just having dinner like in this restaurant and then I just saw like my notification pop up from Interhex like on my email saying like the results and I waited for like a whole five minutes but then I like clicked on it and then it was like a really happy moment because I knew I got in and it was 
yeah, it took me a while to let that sink in. I was pretty relieved. I just, uh, I think I slept after it because I just was done. Um, but yeah, it was a good feeling because then, kind of good feeling then because then we had to wait for a few days for the, for the results if we got in or if we didn't. But I got in, I'm pretty happy about it. I just went out, got food and just like took the whole day to like spend with friends I made here. Cause you can meet friends so easily here. So we all just hung out and just like congratulated each other. After the exam, I was like, uh, actually I had two feelings. One feeling was like, oh, I'm relieved now. Everything is done. And then the other feeling was like, oh, I have to wait a few days now till my uh, results come out. I got an email and I was very happy. I ran upstairs to my mom and showed her the result. And I said, yeah, we did it. <laughs> I was nervous because of English mostly, because it's true when they say that English is the hardest. So I was a bit nervous, but I felt conf very confident about, about biology and chemistry. So I was, my parents were asking me all the time, like, did you get the results and everything? And when I got them, actually, they threw, we have this tradition in Brazil that when someone gets into university, they throw eggs and flour, like raw eggs and flour in your head. So it was a bit of a party. <laughs>